Well, we got our weekly drought update today. No surprise with no rainfall. We are getting uh, drier and drier and we have reason to believe this may go on a while. First of all, that update uh, the drought conditions uh, there in the tan colors spreading across a larger percentage of our eastern counties and then out in the hill country, even some severe drought in Mason County. What we need right now is a transition to an El Nino weather pattern, right? That's where the waters of the Pacific Ocean, especially down near the equator, are warmer than normal. That energizes the southern jet stream during the winter, and we get storm systems that bring us rainfall. Unfortunately, we don't have an El Nino. We have the opposite of an El Nino in place. New information indicating now that it is a strengthening La Nina, meaning the waters in that same area of the Pacific Ocean are cooler than normal. That keeps the polar jet stream generally uh, east to west in the north or northeastern U.S., and we tend to be warmer and drier through the winter months, and that is indeed what our forecast is. Hey, meteorologist Kristen Curry uh, put together a great blog with a whole lot of detailed information about not only our current situation when it comes to La Nina, but what La Nina, El Nino is all about in detail. That's in the weather blog today on KXAN.com.